Hey, yo, what it do, baby? It's your boy Dynamic bringing you episode three of my my career series. As you guys can see, I am adding a ton of attributes to my player. The reason being that I have so many VC because I was playing my GM, and in my GM is really easy to rack up the VC. I don't know if it's the fastest way, but I know it's easy. So I racked up about 3,000 VC, and I'm being really, really, really frugal of how I spend this on my player because I want to have a better overall player. I want to be able to score points plus be a good teammate and everything. So I'm being really, really frugal. I added plus one to my quickness. It doesn't do much, but it's an improvement, whatever I could get in that area. Plus three to consistency because my player was going cold way, way too fast. Plus four to defensive awareness. I wanted to be able to play defense when it switched up or I had to double team. So I wanted to do better in that. I also needed some more offense and to be able to finish drives since I can't dunk. So I added plus two to layup. Again, I needed more offense, so I added plus 18 to shoot off dribble because I want to be able to get open for jumpers, especially mid-range jumpers. I kind of want that to be my specialty, sort of like Stephen Curry or a player like Joe Johnson, something like that. So I added plus four to the three-point shot. I don't want to be a scrub from out there. I want to be a good shooter. Right now, I'm just a mediocre shooter, but anything that I can get in that realm would, is a welcome addition. Plus two to shot medium. And that in combination with shoot off dribble makes me a lot harder to defend. I kept turning the ball over a lot, so I added plus two to my ball security to make it harder for me to lose the ball or the defender to get a steal or whatnot. I added plus two to passing, so I would say I'm a good passer now. Not great or elite, but at least good, you know. So, and I didn't have a lot of money left, so I added plus one to my offensive awareness. You know what? What the heck? What could go wrong? So here we are in the game playing the Brooklyn Nets. Look at Darren Williams looking like he's about to go ham on us. I don't know. It doesn't even look like Darren Williams, to be honest here. I am dribbling the ball up the court. I've been practicing on my isolation moves, my iso moves a little bit, my dribbling. And as you can see, I had the nice low pass there. So... I actually did pretty good this game. You guys will see a lot of highlights from me. I was going berserk. Look at me trying to get Derek. Oh, my God. All the way to the basket. Draw a foul. That's how we do it, baby. That's how we get off to a good start. Already got two points. Oh, with the spin cycle and a step back. Oh, got him. See that sweet move? I've actually been practicing all that stuff, guys. I'm getting used to the controllers a little bit now. I've actually started using plays. I still don't know how to do a simple plays. I haven't really, you know, got all into that. But the complicated ones, I've actually been doing kind of like the same play all over. Oh, my God. Another step back. Hit him with that. Ooh. Look at that. It's so sweet. The fade is in, baby. The fade is in. Baba, hook me up. Hook me up, Baba. So as you guys were able to see right there, my moves have improved a heck of a lot. Here comes Darren Williams. I'm trying to play that lockdown D. I'm trying to play that good D. He turns around. He goes straight to the basket, draws a foul. I can't do nothing about that. Couldn't do nothing in that situation. He comes back. Remember, I improved my perimeter defense when I played against Tony Parker. So I'm a little bit more prepared to face these kind of point guards now. These quick break you down off the dribble point guards. So I'm trying. Oh, my God. I got that lockdown, baby. I ain't messing up this time. I ain't messing. He's backing me down, though. I'm weak. My low post defense is weak, but I managed to get that good shot defense on him. And there's nothing you could do. That's the best you could ask for right there in that situation. Look at that play I'm doing. Oh, my gosh. With that jumper. My jumper is wet. Get that umbrella, baby. My jumper is wet. I'm dripping wet in the homo. So anyways, I'm orchestrating the offense right here. I'm bringing in Fry. I'm getting some separation. I'm going to do the only move that I like so far. And I get that pick. He says to pick again. I shoot another jumper and my jumper is wet again. Get the umbrellas out because it's dripping wet out here. I'm dropping jumpers like nothing. There was one second left on the clock. And the quarter is over. It is now halftime. Now we are back in the third quarter with two minutes left to go. They get... Oh! What type of party is it, baby? It's a black party. So I'm coming back with the spin sight, doing some dribble moves, trying to go around this scrub right here. So I get a little 
close to medium range jumper right in his face. I'm doing good. I'm feeling the swagger. Meanwhile, Darren Williams is trying to one-up me. He's trying to show who the best point guard in this game is. So you know what? I decided to double team, but he takes a shot straight in my face. I don't know what the hell happened. I played good shot defense, but he still made the shot. I think right here, my little quest is to get 10 straight points and score 10 straight points. So you know, I'm like, well, I'm going to score that. I'm going to score that. I do that little pick play I like doing, and I got a free lane straight to the basket. I'm doing amazing. Look at that shooting percentage. 75% from the field so far. Oh, man, what a behind the back by Darren. Nice little pass. Gets blocked. We're on a fast break. Number 21 is on a fast break. Oh, my God. Stop and pop. Hit him with Oh, man. Stephen Curry all over the place. That's my Stephen Curry move right there. That's the reason why I decided to up my mid-range, to be honest. And that shoot off the dribble because I was actually off the dribble while I was running and all that stuff. So I poked the ball away. Oh my God, my guy is turning into a into a little. I'm not gonna say he's a star out there, but he's he's definitely on his way, definitely on his way on a fast break score again. Oh my God, he's clapping, he's clapping. He knows he knows the fans are on his side. KG, what you gonna do, baby? Oh man, he missed. It's back on a fast break. Oh, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Oh, straight to the hole and a foul. And a foul, baby. Joe Johnson can't believe it. Joe Johnson can't believe it. I'm on fire right now. I'm doing the best that I possibly could trying to score these 10 straight points. Okay, they blocked me. Let's do it. Let's go back. Let's set it up. Cross them. Mid-range. That's why I upped the attributes. Darren Williams can't believe it. He don't know how good I am right now. I got taken out of the game. Put back. 33 seconds left. They're following me. They're following me. I don't think I was able to get the 10 straight points. I have no clue. Maybe, maybe not. Let's see if at the end of the game I got that dynamic goal. We won by 8 points. It was over. It's a wrap. The Nets are terrible this season. We all know that. So, yes, I was able to get that 10 straight points. Look at the dynamic goal. One, I had it. Dynamic goal two, I had that also. So, I managed to get 452 points and up some of my attributes again. My player is going up pretty, pretty quickly, especially because I'm going to keep playing that my GM mode and keep racking up the points. Anyways, my time is over, guys. Rate, comment, subscribe, and peace out, players. Oh, my game.